What is going on guys welcome back to another Android application development video in Android Studio. In this video we are going to learn how to add bottom app navigation in our application. So at the end of this video we are going to accept this. I will open this application. So we have bottom navigation bar where we have three items home notification and setting. So when I click on notification it will go to notification fragment. When I click on settings it will go to settings fragment and when I click on home fragment it will go to home fragment. So let's get it started. So I have already created a project with empty activity. There is nothing but hello world here. So let's go to build.gradle file and check the dependency. If you have material dependency over here by default, you don't need to add anything. If you don't have by default, I will provide it in the description box. So let's close this and go to activity main.xml. First we will remove this hello world text view and make this constant layout to relative layout. And we will add here bottom navigation view. So bottom navigation view width match parent height wrap content and we will give the id bottom navigation we will align it to bottom true and for the bottom items whatever we want to add we have to create a menu. So let's go to resource new android resource directory we will select menu over here and click on ok. It will create a menu directory and inside that we will create a file menu resource file. So we'll give it the name bottom nav menu and we will add items over here. So item id id first item I want to add is home title a home and icon I want to give I will create an icon also. So let's go to drawable new vector asset click here and add the home icon. So I will take this and I will finish it. Again I will create two more icons. So vector asset second is notification. I will take this and finish third icon I will take settings. So all three icons are added in my drawable. So I will add one by one for home. I will give home icon. I will copy this item and paste it below it. And second item will be notification. I will give the ID title also notification and icon. I have notification. Same thing I will do for settings also. ID will be settings title settings icon settings. So we have created the menu with the items you can add maximum five items. So let's go to activity main.xml back and in bottom navigation view add that menu. So app menu bottom navigation menu. So in main activity we have added bottom navigation menu one frame layout we have to add above it. So let's add that frame layout we'll give match parent match parent and we will give id for this that will be container for us and it will be above bottom navigation bar. So in main activity we have added bottom navigation view and above that we have added the frame layout. So now let's create the fragments for us. We have to create three fragments that is home fragment, notification fragment and settings fragment. So let's go here and new fragment blank fragment will give the name first one is home fragment. So I can remove all this boilerplate code. So can leave on create view and I can remove all this and in fragment home.xml I will remove this text view make this relative layout and add a simple text view with wrap content and wrap content that will be home fragment with center in parent true. So I will increase the size also. So this will be our home fragment for now. Now let's create notification fragment and also settings fragment new fragment notification fragment I'll do the same and I'll copy from fragment home and paste it on fragment notification and I will write this as notification fragment one last fragment we will create for settings so fragment settings fragment I'll remove this and I will paste it in 
settings also and I will write this settings fragment now we have all three fragments ready let's close all this and go to main activity and here we have to initialize bottom navigation view we will give the name bottom navigation view and also we will initialize all three fragment so home fragment is equal to new home fragment in the same way settings fragment and notification fragment so we have initialized all three fragments let's go to uncreate method and provide the id for bottom navigation view that we have created r dot id dot bottom navigation so in activity main dot xml we have this frame layout so this frame layout by default will be home fragment so when we open the app for the first time it should be home fragment and when we click on bottom navigation bars icons it should be changed so let's replace this frame layout with home fragment at first so get support fragment manager dot begin transactions dot replace that we will replace container with home fragment dot we will commit this so this will help to replace the container that is frame layout with our home fragment while we open the app now we will add on item selected listener on bottom navigation view so bottom navigation view dot set on item selected listener new on item selected listener so on item selected we can remove this not null annotation so on item selected we will check if the item is home or settings or notification so switch item dot get item id so it will switch and in case of r dot id dot home in case of r dot id dot home we will copy this code that will replace the container with the home fragment and we will return true same thing we will do for all three cases so i'll copy this when it is notification it should be notification fragment when it is settings it should be settings fragment so we are done with the bottom navigation so now let's run the application and check what it is showing so our application is running so by default our home fragment is loaded because we have replaced the container with home fragment so when we click on notification bottom icon it will go to notification fragment when we click on setting icon it will go to settings fragment so our bottom navigation bar is working perfectly fine so one more feature we can add for bottom navigation view that is the badge thing like we have eight notification we can show the notification as eight as badge so let's do that so i'll go to on create method and i will get badge drawable i will name it badge drawable bottom navigation view dot get or create badge r dot id dot notification we want to create the badge in notification item so in notification we will get the badge and we will set that badge drawable visible as true and we will set a number that is the notification whatever we get set number i'll set it 8 for now and i will run the application again so yeah you can see this 8 notification badge in our notification tab so in this way you can add the bottom navigation bar with the fragment in your application. So if you enjoyed this video please hit the like button. If you have any doubts and queries please comment below. I will reply for you. And don't forget to subscribe for this type of videos. See you in the next video. Bye bye.